chanting the holy name is the most important limb of our bhakti process shila prabhupad said 99% of our advancement is on the basis of the quantity and quality of our chanting and many times you can see in the purport shila prabhupad says chanting constantly always chanting incessantly chanting right these terms are used in the purports of shila prabhupad and whenever shila prabhupad has to mention the hare krishna maha mantra prabhupad will not just mention hare krishna maha mantra he will mention the incessant chanting of hare krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare hare because you never know it's possible that the person can read only one purport in his life it's possible that he may get a book he may read one purport and never read again he may not become a devotee but at least the benefit of reading that one purport where the whole hare krishna maha mantra is there is eternally attained by that living entity so or if let's say he reads one purport and somehow mysteriously that happens to be the day of his departure he will not be able to read any other book or any other purport in the future but at least reading the hare krishna maha mantra and pronouncing the hare krishna maha mantra completely gives eternal credit so today in our discussion we will see what we gain by chanting hari naam many times devotees complain i have no taste in chanting japa kirtan somehow we can manage because of the melody right because of the tune we can manage because there are other devotees also there kirtan we can also manage because there is kartal mridanga harmonium so all of that keeps us uh, interested and sometimes there is dancing jumping running <laughs> so all of that keeps us excited in kirtan but in japa there is real test because we are sitting alone of course we are chanting with devotees but it is an individual effort to chant our own rounds and at the same time we are sitting and chanting we are chanting with no melody we are just hare krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare hare it's not like a hare krishna hare krishna <laughs> like there is no melody and at the same time there are no instruments and it's not that you just do a 10 15 minute kirtan and then the class will begin or little kirtan at the end just before prasadam it's not like that japa is two hours serious business sitting down serious business not looking around but focusing so to get taste before ruchi is a stage called as nishtha we have to be fixed in chanting we must take one vow that i must chant as much as possible even when i am doing other services my tongue should be chanting we should not waste our time yes i may be serving prasadam uh, to vaishnavas but i don't have to speak right i don't have to chit chat only i have to ask will you take more or do you need little sabji or do you need little khichdi that's all i have to ask the devotee but remaining time i can keep chanting mahaprabhu says khaite shuite jatha tatha naam lo desh kal niyam nahi sarva siddhi ho in the last chapter of chaitanya charitamrit shri chaitanya mahaprabhu he explains that uthite bashite khaite shuite jatha tatha naam lo uthte baithte khate sote samay bhi naam lo this is mahaprabhu's words and desh kal niyam nahi sarva siddhi ho na desh ka niyam hai na samay ka niyam hai keval siddhi pradan hoti hai naam japne se by chanting the holy name there is only and only spiritual advancement that we will gain yes lust may be troubling anger may be troubling envy may be troubling material desires may be troubling aparadh is troubling the desire to criticize is there we are finding faults no problem we don't have to act on it that's all let all these things come no problem we should not act if we act on any of these emotions oh then they remain alive they remain alive Mm, there is anger and we give in and we start shouting or oh, then that anger emotion remains alive we have to learn to starve anger starve greed starve lust and that happens only by chanting the holy name nirantara krishna naam jahara vadane sei vaishnava shreshtha bhaja tahara charane shri chaitanya mahaprabhu was asked who is a vaishnava and i request all of you to very attentively take note of the definition that shri chaitanya mahaprabhu gave mahaprabhu was asked who is a vaishnava not only mathe tilak kanthimala because having tilak in kanthimala yes it is very important it is most important 
the attire of a Vaishnava is very important. But what is the actual definition that Mahaprabhu gave? Mahaprabhu said, Nirantara Krishna Nam Jahara Bodhane, in whose mouth there is constant chanting of Krishna's name. Sei Vaishnava Sresht Bhaja Tahara Charane. He is the best among Vaishnavas, and our duty is to serve his lotus feet. <laughs> This is the definition of Vaishnava. And you can see the importance of chanting Harina found everywhere in Chaitanya Charitamrita. Everywhere. In the uplifting pastime of the prostitute. Very famous pastime. Again, all these pastimes, I'm just giving Sanket, which means I'm just hinting. I'm not narrating them. Because I hope that uh, most of us have heard these pastimes. If we haven't, then that can be the homework after the session to know what that pastime was. In the pastime of Namacharya Haridas Thakur uplifting the prostitute, the prostitute asks Srila Haridas Thakur, how can somebody as fallen as me make an advancement? I karani ho. Maine to sabhi paap kiye, sabhi aparad kiye. Kya mera bhi uddhar hoga? Kya ye sambhav hai? Is it possible that even I will be uplifted? Sometimes this question comes in even in our minds, right? When we think of so many mistakes that we have done before coming to Krishna consciousness, even after coming to Krishna consciousness, how many devotees we have hurt, how many times we have been very aggressive, unnecessarily angry, uddhatpana, bolnyat, astat, sarvancha jivanat astat, maja jivanat, maja ayushattarahi, bhar bharu nahi. I have been very... Uh, uh, very arrogant in my speech and I still continue to be. So, um, in this way, we have to analyze and see what mistakes we have made. And then we have this question, can I also make advancement? Srila Haridas Thakur says, Nirantara Nam Lo Kara Tulasi Sevan Achirata Pave Tumi Krishnera Charan That you have to do only two things. Constantly keep Krishna's name in your mouth and serve the Vaishnavas Starting with Tulsi Devi. Tulasira Sevan. By serving Tulsi Devi and by keeping the holy name constantly on the tongue, we will never be cheated. We will get Krishna's lotus feet. Srila Haridas Thakur has said this. Can his words ever go wrong, dear devotees? He who is chanting 300,000 names of Krishna, can his words ever go wrong? He is saying that for our benefit. Nirantara Nam Lokara Tulasi Sevan Achirata Pave to me Krishna Charan Achirat Chirkal Ka Artha in the future. But Achirata means very quickly, right now, Satyo. Immediately. Achirata Pave to me Krishna Charan. You will get Krishna's lotus feet if you constantly chant. We can see another pastime. In the pastime of Murgari. When Narada Muni uplifts Mrigari, there also he says, Nirantara Namlo, constantly chant Krishna's name. It is not one place in Shastra where it is said, constantly keep the holy name in your mouth. No, everywhere this is found. And I will try to share a few more references. Of course, walking with beads every day, all the time may not be possible. But Krishna has fit a tongue in our mouth. How merciful he is. All that we want is a tongue. There is never a possibility that we go somewhere and we remember, oh, I have to chant the holy name, but what to do? I left my tongue at home. How will I chant now? <laughs> that situation will never come. Krishna is so kind. He has given the tongue in the mouth. And it's not even that, oh, I have the tongue, but now how do I get? Holy name is easily available, freely available, available to one and all. And the tongue is fit in everybody's mouth. What is the difficulty, Prabhupada asked? What is the difficulty? I would like to share one nice verse in Shastra. Ahani ahani bhutani gachanti yama mandiram sheshahasthavaram ichanti kimashchari matahaparam. This verse we all know. That Yudhishthir Maharaj, when he was asked, what is the most astonishing thing in this world? He said the most astonishing thing in this world is everybody is dying one after another. And those who are left behind, they think, I will live forever. It happened to him, it happened to him, it happened to him, it happened to him. But I, in the middle, I will remain. This is Ashcharyam. 
But you know what is more ashcharyam than this? The shas, the, in the scriptures, there is another verse which talks about even bigger ashcharyam. And the verse goes like this. Sulabhan Bhagavan Nama Jivvacha Vashavartini Tathapi Narakam Yantim Ki Mashcharya Matahaparam Sulabham Bhagavan Nama Bhagavan Ki Nama Itne Sulabh Hai Itne Asan Tarike Se Wo Uplabh Hai Krishna's names are so easily available And what about the tongue? Jivvacha Vashavartini And the tongue is fit in the mouth the names that you have to chant is easily available, freely available. And at the same time, um, the tongue that is needed is fit in the mouth. And still people manage to go to hell. Tathapi narakam yantim. Kim param. What can be more astonishing than this? One name of Krishna can protect us from hell. Names are easily available. Tongue is fit in the mouth. Still people go to hell. What can be more astonishing than this? This is a verse in Shastra. Sulabham Bhagavan Nama Jivhacha Vashavartini Tathapi Narakam Yantim Kim Ashtariya Matahaparam The best way to counteract all reactions, the best way to cleanse our heart, the best way to get liberated from all problems, the best way to realize our eternal identity, the best way to have darshan of Krishna, the best way to go back home, back to God, the best way to develop service attitude, the best way to overcome all our faults, the best way to never enter another mother's womb, and the best way to be fixed in eternal service of Radha and Krishna and Mahaprabhu in the spiritual world is to simply chant Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare. It is very simple. But because it is very easily available, we don't take advantage of this process. My Guru Maharaj would give the example that in the villages, if a person feels dizzy and he goes to the doctor, the doctor will say, oh, it's just uh, your pressure has dropped a bit. You just drink little limbu pani and you'll be fine. Limbu pani peel or ho jaoge. And the person starts complaining. I walked all the way to come to you and you're telling me just to drink limbu pani. Ek to lagao thodi. Matlab, injection, injection lagao. Abhi aapke paas aye hai. Lagna to chahiye na ki doctor ke paas aye hai. Ye limbu pani to hum ghar pe bhi pee sakte hai. Doctor says, but you don't need injection. <laughs> you just need limbu pani. You'll be fine. The person doesn't have faith. How can something so simple be effective? Only when there is some injection, he feels, ah, the doctor has done something worthwhile. Similarly, only when there is five, six hours of yajna and there is uh, smoke all over the place and eyes are burning because of the fire and everybody is doing ah, 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 so, ah, ah, ah. Only then we feel something big has happened. That is like the injection. But Harinam seems to be like drinking Nimbu Pani. But trust me, Nimbu Pani will work in Kali Yuga. <laughs> Nimbu Pani will work in Kali Yuga. Haridas Thakur has said in Chaitanya Charita Amrit, Koti Ashwa Medha Eka Krishna Nama Sam. If somebody says that performing one crore Ashwa Medha Yajnas will equal one name of the Lord, Jai Kohe Sei Pashandi Dande Tara Jam. Anybody who says this, he is faithless. Srila Haridas Thakur is saying, Koti Ashwa Medha Eka Krishna Nama Sam. Jai Kahe Sei Pashandi Dande Tara Yam. <laughs> Which means if somebody says one crore Ashwa Medha Yatnyas equal one name of the Lord, Haridas Thakur is saying, I say such a person is a rascal, Pashandi. And he will be punished by Yamaraj for saying this. <laughs> this is the power potency of Krishna now. What do we think of Krishna's holy name? We think it is some material sound vibration. We think it is, it is uh, very easy to chant. We have transmigrated over so many lifetimes to get this human form. Labdva sudurlabham idam bahusam bhavante manushyam arthadam anityam apihadhira turnam yateta napateta anumrityu yavat nishreya saya vishayam khalu sarvatasyat. Canto 11, chapter 9, text 29, Bhagavat. Bhagavatam says, Labdva sudurlabham idam bahusam bhavante. After so many lifetimes of going through different bodies, 
so durlabham idam we have attained this human form of life which is so rarely attained and that to after getting manushyam arthadam this is the only form which can give you love of god this is the only form with, from which we can get liberated this is the only form we can burn down all our reactions no animal species can do that the species under us they only suffer and the species above us they only enjoy <laughs> like when we go to heaven you go there and it is like getting taking money into a shopping mall you can only spend and buy stuff that's all and when we when we go in we go in as indra when we come out we come out as sudama right all the money is gone <laughs> so in heaven it is like that you can only spend as soon as we enter punya kshine punya marti lokam vishanti deduction has begun everything that we enjoy there eating drinking sleeping enjoying some music enjoying some position as some demigod our past punya gets deducted 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 and amid so much enjoyment we cannot chant krishna's name because there is no need we feel why should we chant i am enjoying anyway and in species below us there is only suffering species above us only enjoyment and species below us only suffering look how uh, helpless the animals get amid freezing cold amid so much heat extreme rain accidents are taking place animals are trying to cross the road and the car is hitting and so many animals die so many get hunted down by humans and other animals and what to speak of going to hell so much suffering we cannot chant the holy name there only species where we can chant krishna naam is human form neither so much enjoyment like the demigods nor so much suffering like the animals we are comfortable most suitable arthadam bhagavatam says this is the only body this is the only ship that we as the soul are sitting into which can take us bhav par bhav sagar par भज हुरे मन श्री नंद नंदन अभय चरणार विंदरे दुर्लभ मानव जनम सत्संगे तरहु ए भव सिंधु रे अरे हे मूर्ख मानव शरीर प्राप्त करके भव सागर में खेल रहा है क्या कर रहा है इतनी सुंदर व्यवस्था प्रभु बनाए हैं चौरासी लाख योनियों का भ्रमण बंद करके बीच से मानव शरीर दिया है ताकि भव सागर पार हो सके और हम क्या कर रहे हैं पानी में तैर रहे हैं डूब रहे हैं यहां वहां जा रहे हैं पार होने के लिए दिया है नौका ना कि नौके में नौका विहार करने के लिए नौका विहार ठाकुर करेंगे <laughs> राधा वृंदावन चंद्र विल डू नौका विहार वी एस द सोल इन द नौका ऑफ दिस बॉडी डोंट हैव टू डू विहार इन दिस वर्ल्ड वी हैव टू क्रॉस एंड द बेस्ट वे टू क्रॉस इज निरंतर कृष्ण नाम बाय कॉन्स्टेंटली चैंटिंग कृष्ण विल टेक एस वी डोंट हैव टू वरी we don't have to worry if the mother has two children the older son is more responsible he goes to the airport he takes the baggage he you know he takes the uh, the check in he gives him the baggage check in and then he goes through security boarding pass and getting to the seat of the air the airline he does all that because he's more responsible what about the little child mummy yeah just crying so what about the check in and the security and the seat for the little one whose responsibility mother's responsibility because the child doesn't know anything and raising his hand is just saying mummy 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 so the mother picks up mother goes through security child also goes through security mother finds her seat child also gets her seat the child is on the lap of the mother the older son is more independent so mother is not paying so much attention but the younger child is helplessly just calling mommy mommy so the mother takes care the path of devotion is not to become the older child the path of devotion is to become the younger child to become helpless raise our hand and tell the supreme lord hari krishna hari krishna 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 hari 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 ram hari ram 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 hari hari just like the child calls out mommy daddy we keep calling radhe krishna radharani and mahaprabhu and krishna that's all 
ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀ ಅದ್ವೈತ ಗದಾಧರ ಶ್ರೀ ವಾಸದಿ ಗೌರ ಭಕ್ತ ವೃಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರಿ ಹರೇ ಹರಿ ರಾಮ ಹರಿ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರಿ ಹರಿ ದೆನ್ ವಟ್ ಡು ದ ಸುಪ್ರೀಂ ಲಾರ್ಡ್ ಡು ದೇ ಟೇಕ್ ಕೇರ್ ಆಫ್ ಅಸ್ ಅಹಂ ತ್ವಾಂ ಸರ್ವ ಪಾಪೇಭ್ಯ ಮೋಕ್ಷಿಷ್ಯಾಮಿ ಮಾಶು ಚ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಸೇ ಇಫ್ ಯು ವಾಂಟ್ ಟು ಬಿಕಮ್ ದ ಓಲ್ಡರ್ ಚೈಲ್ಡ್ ನೋ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ ಯತ್ ಕರೋಷಿ ಯದ್ ಅಷ್ಟಾಸಿ ಯಜ್ ಹೋಷಿ ದಾಸಿ ಯದ್ ಯತ್ ತಪಸ್ಸಿ ಕೌಂತೆಯ ತತ್ ಕುರುಷ ಮದರ್ಪಣ ಡೂ ವಾಟ್ ಎವರ್ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಆಫರ್ ಇಟ್ ಟು ಮೀ ಬಟ್ ಇಫ್ ಯು ವಾಂಟ್ ಟು ಬಿಕಮ್ ದ ಯಂಗರ್ ಚೈಲ್ಡ್ ಸರ್ವಧರ್ಮಾನ್ ಪರಿತ್ಯಜ್ಯ ಛೋಡ್ ದೋ ಸಬ್ ಕುಚ್ ಆಂಡ್ ಸರ್ವಧರ್ಮಾನ್ ಪರಿತ್ಯಜ್ಯ ಮಾಮ್ ಏಕಂ ಶರಣಂ ಬ್ರಜ ಬಟ್ ಇನ್ ಕಲಿಯುಗ ಕಲಿ ಕಾಲೆ ನಾಮ ರೂಪೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಅವತಾರ್ ದಟ್ ಮಾಮ್ ಏಕಂ ಮೀ ಬಿಕಮ್ಸ್ ನಾಮ್ ಏಕಂ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಅಪಿಯರ್ಸ್ ಎಸ್ ನಾಮ್ ಸೊ ಸರ್ವಧರ್ಮಾನ್ ಪರಿತ್ಯಜ್ಯ ನಾಮ್ ಏಕಂ ಶರಣಂ ಬ್ರಜ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಇಸ್ ಸೈಂಗ್ ಗಿವ್ ಅಪ್ ಎವ್ರಿಥಿಂಗ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಟೇಕ್ ಶೆಲ್ಟರ್ ಆಫ್ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ನಾಮ್ and if we do that aham tvam sarva papebhyo mokshishyami i will deliver you of everything so not that we have to give up other services we continue everything but the mouth is constantly chanting aho batashwa pachato gariyan yaj jibhagre vartate nama tubhya canto 3 chapter 33 text 6 and 7 kapila muni when he is speaking to mother devahuti Mother Devahuti says, all glories, all glories to those tongues of your devotees, which are constantly vibrating the holy name. Constantly vibrating the holy name. Dear devotees, when Shripad Vallabhacharya Ji met Mahaprabhu, in, this is given in Chaitanya Charita Amrita. When Shripad Vallabhacharya Ji met Mahaprabhu, at that time, Rupa Goswami was also there. And looking at Rupa Goswami, Shri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu thought of um, playing some uh, trick <laughs> on Shri Pad Vallabhacharya and told Shri Pad Vallabhacharya, don't associate closely with this person. Oh, he's very fallen. <laughs> Talking about Rupa Goswami. He's very fallen. He, um, you know, associates with Nawab Hussain Shah and, uh, you know, he's, he's into the government services. Don't associate closely with him. <laughs> and Shripad Vallabh Acharya Ji immediately looks at the lips of Rupa Goswami and Shila Rupa Goswami's lips are moving Shila Vallabh Acharya Ji looks at the lips of Rupa Goswami and tells Mahaprabhu how can there be any sin in his life his tongue is constantly moving chanting the holy name <laughs> <laughs> and he quotes this verse yaj jibhagre vartate nama tubhyam prand bhagavatam that personality whose lips and tongue are constantly moving chanting the holy name how can there be any sin in their life therefore i think they is very worthy to associate with and shri chaitanya mahaprabhu smiles and he said your conclusions are accurate he is very advanced this is shila rupa goswami <laughs> this is very very wonderful in the past time of mrigari as i was previously explaining also mrigari he commits so many mistakes and then when he asks narad muni how do i make advancement shila narad muni says never make those mistakes again break your bow you've been a hunter break your bow and don't kill any more animals and constantly chant krishna's name nirantara krishna naam don't worry about it krishna will maintain and then mrigari becomes transformed into a very great disciple and this transformation happens why because of constant chanting of the holy name constant chanting nacho gao bhakta sange karo sankirtan achirata pave tumi krishna ra charan this verse has also come in chaitanya bhagavat that in the association of devotees constantly chant krishna's name and definitely you will have darshan of krishna this is given this promise has been given we have to understand that <clears throat> just like during makar sankranti you know especially in maharashtra i am pretty sure now also but at least uh, 20 years ago when i was uh, younger we used to fly kites on top of the terrace right and of course i have not done it in 20 years now after that but uh, i remember from that experience that flying kites means holding the thread if you hold and somehow manage the thread then you can manage the kite from a distance when you look at the kite it seems as if the kite is independent is it not it looks as if the kite is independently moving 
But when you go closer, you can see that there is a person holding the thread who is managing the kite. Either he is letting go or he is bringing close. Is it not? And what happens when that thread is cut? The kite independently moves. The person and the kite have no sambandhada. From this example, we can learn Krishna is the kite. Abhidnya Swarat. Swarat means independent. From a distance, when you see the kite, it seems as if it is completely independent. So Krishna, for outsiders, he may seem to be completely independent. Independent Lord. When, when you go closer on the path of bhakti and we hear more Hari Katha, we understand Krishna is not independent. Aham bhakta paradhino yasvatantra ivo dvijaha sadhu bhi grastaridayam bhaktai bhakta janapriya. Krishna is always under his devotees. So Krishna is like a kite. When you see him from a distance, it seems as if he is independently moving. But when you go close, you understand that that kite is controlled by a kite flyer who is a pure Vaishnava. <laughs> The kite is flying according to how the kite flyer is using. So depending on how the devotion of the devotee is, Krishna either comes close or he does other things depending on the desire of the devotee. But what is the connection between the kite flyer and the kite? It is the thread. What is the connection between the devotee and the Lord? It is the thread called the holy name. How wonderful. The more we hold on to the thread, the holy name, to that extent, the kite gets controlled by us. <laughs> this is given in Shastra. Naham vasami vaikunthe yoginam rita yeshuva yatra gayanti madhaktaha tatra tishthami narada. O Narada, I don't live in the hearts of the yogis and I don't live in Vaikuntha. Where do I live? Where my devotees sing my glories and call out my names. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare. Where my devotees call out my names. Tatra Tishthami Narada. I appear there. Also, we can see in Nilkantha Goswami's Kevalashtakam. Hari Vased, Hari Sada Vased Tatra, Yatra Bhagavata Jana, Gayanti Bhakti Bhavena, Hare Namaiva Kevalam. That Krishna eternally resides in that place where the devotees chant his names. This has been given. So if the devotee is like a kite flyer and Krishna is the kite, the holy name is the thread. The more we pull the thread, the more the kite comes closer. And the more we slacken in our thread, the kite moves farther. Which means if we chant sincerely and constantly and nicely, then the kite called Krishna comes closer and closer and closer and closer. <laughs> and if we just slacken in our chanting, we chant like this. Then what happens? We are letting go of the thread and the kite goes far, 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 far. <laughs> and if we stop chanting, it is like cutting the thread. The sambandha only is finished. The living entity and the Supreme Lord, they have eternal relationship, but we will not be able to realize that without chanting the holy name. So chanting the holy name is the most important limb of bhakti. Also in other places we can find in Shastra. Like the Bhakti Rasamrita Sindhu. 64 limbs of bhakti are given. But in that the top 5 limbs of bhakti are association with pure Vaishnavas. Studying Srimad Bhagavatam. Residing in the Dham. Worshipping the deities. And chanting the holy name. I'll repeat that again. The five top limbs of bhakti given in Bhakti Rasamrita Sindhu are association with pure Vaishnavas, studying Srimad Bhagavatam, worshipping the deities, residing in a holy place, and fifth, chanting the holy name. In Bengali, that has been poetically put together by Srila Krishnadas Kaviraj Goswami as Sadhu Sangha Nama Kirtan Bhagavata Shravan. Mathura Vasa Shri Murti Rashrathaya Sevan. But Srila Prabhupada Saraswati Thakur writes that these five limbs of bhakti can also be condensed into Ekanga Bhakti. 64 limbs of bhakti have been got down to Panchanga Bhakti, top five. And Srila Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Thakur says, out of these five, there is one perfect, complete and perfect. And then remaining four are depending on this one. He says the 
ekanga bhakti is naam sankirtan naam kirtan to call out to the names of krishna and he said everything else depends on that like for example you cannot worship the deity without chanting the invocatory mantras but without chanting the holy name how can we worship the deities even to offer we have to chant the holy name even to offer pushpa you have to chant the holy name similarly how can we read bhagavatam reading bhagavatam reading bhagavatam reading bhagavatam may make one a scholar but what is the essence of the bhagavatam मृयमाणो हरेर्नाम गृणन पुत्रोपचारित अजामिलोप्य गाधाम किमुत श्रद्धया गृणन अजामिल स्टोरी गजेंद्र स्टोरी प्रहलाद स्टोरी एंड द्रौपदी स्कॉल ब्रिंग अस ओनली टू वन पॉइंट नाम संकीर्तन यर्वपाप प्रनाशन प्रणामो दुख शमन स्तम नमा हरिं परम द लास्ट वर्ष ऑफ भागवतम से कॉन्स्टंटली चैंटिंग द होली नेम इज द एसेन्स ऑफ भागवतम टू ऑफर ओबेसेंसेस टू एवरीबडी स्टार्टिंग विथ हरि गुरु एंड वैष्णवस and to constantly keep the holy name on the tongue is the performance of all bhakti right this studying of bhagavatam also is fructified in chanting third limb association with saintly vaishnavas how do you know somebody is saintly <laughs> just quoting shlokas and singing songs is doesn't make one saintly that even professional reciters and professional singers can those who constantly chant krishna's name they are saintly is it not they are saintly so even when we are worshiping the deities even when we are making garlands even when we are cooking at the temple even when we are sweeping and mopping the floor even when we are serving prasadam hands can move but the tongue should also move we can see that lot of time is wasted in gramya vartha lot of time इसने ऐसे कहा उसने ऐसे कहा ऐसा तो बोलना नहीं चाहिए था अभी मैनेजमेंट में है तो उसका ये मतलब नहीं कि कुछ भी बोलेंगे ऐसा नहीं बोलना है वी शुड नॉट फ्रीली टॉक द टंग वेन इट इज गिवन अ चांस वी डोंट नो होम वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट वी टॉक अबाउट टेम्पल मैनेजमेंट वी टॉक अबाउट जीबीसी वी टॉक अबाउट सन्यासी वी टॉक अबाउट सीनियर वैष्णवर्स दिस इज अ डाउन स्लोप दिस इज अ पैथ ऑफ डिस्ट्रॉइंग अवर कृष्णा कॉन्शियसनेस इन स्टेड दैट टाइम शुड बी यूटिलाइज इन हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 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 कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे किन से क्या वार्ता है वाई डिड वी ज्वाइन द ब्रह्मचार्य आश्रम इट इज टू गिव अप ऑल अदर डिस्ट्रैक्शन एंड सर्व कृष्ण वन पॉइंट इज इट नॉट दैट इज अवर स्पिरिट वाई शुड वी गेट डिस्ट्रैक्टेड Why should we speak about speak about other things? Bhalo na khai be, aro bhalo na kori be. Gram me katha na shuni be, gram me katha na boli be. Braje Radha Krishna Monasi seva kori be. This is the instruction Mahaprabhu gave Shila Raghunath Das Goswami. Not to talk much, but instead use that time and the tongue to chant. Machine ki tarah naam agar chalate rahe. जैसे प्रभुपाद मशीन होता है हरे कृष्णा हरे कृष्णा 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 हरे हरे आवर टंग शुड बिकम लाइक दैट मशीन मॉर्निंग वी वेक अप मीन्स मशीन इज ऑन नाइट वी गो ऑफ टू स्लीप मीन्स मशीन इज क्लोज एंड इफ वी प्रैक्टिस लाइक दैट इवन इन द स्लीप वी मे चैट एंड दैट इज परफेक्शन दैट इज परफेक्शन सिक्सटीन राउंड वी आर चैंटिंग ऑन द बीट्स एज मिनिमम बट रिमेनिंग टाइम ऑल्सो टंग मस्ट मूव One time, one South Indian man came to one of our Iskon temples, and Shri Prabhupada asked him, "How did you find the temple?" So you know, typically in South Indian temples, you have a bell outside. So this uh, this South Indian man, he said, uh, "The temple is good, but there is no temple bell <laughs> because you see, <laughs> there is no bell in the entry point." Shila Prabhupada said, "South Indian temples they have one bell, but Iskon temples means they have bell fit into everybody's mouth in the form of the tongue, which is constantly ringing. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare. The tongue is the bell, which is constantly ringing inside, constantly ringing inside. So this should be the spirit to chant. Samay bacha bacha kar naam jab karna. Samay bacha bacha kar." दो सर्विसेज के बीच में पंद्रह मिनट है तो आई कैन चैन टू थ्री राउंड्स एट दैट टाइम प्रसाद के लिए और पांच मिनट है एक माला कर सकता हूं दर्शनार्थी खुलने से पहले अगर पांच सात मिनट है तो एक माला कर सकता हूं मैं क्यों अन्य वार्ता करूं वाई शुड आई स्पीक एक्स्ट्रा वाई डिड आई ज्वाइन द आश्रम इट इज टू गेट द सर्विस ऑफ राधा एंड कृष्णा इज इट नॉट वाई डिड वी बिकम ब्रह्मचारी वाई डिड वी ज्वाइन द आश्रम वाई डिड वी गिव अप एवरीथिंग 
it is to get the lotus feet of radha and krishna why should when i have to go east why should i turn left why should i turn left mujhe radha kund ki taraf jana hai to main phir ghoom kar lohi bazar ki taraf kyon jaun kyon jaun मुझे जाना नहीं है आई डोंट हैव एनीथिंग टू बाय फ्रॉम लोई बाजार आई हैव टू गो टू राधा कुंड और गोवर्धन परिक्रमा सिमिलरली इफ माय पर्पस इन लाइफ इज टू मूव टुवर्ड्स मेकिंग एडवांसमेंट ऑन द पाथ ऑफ भक्ति व्हाई शुड आई टॉक अदर थिंग्स व्हाई नॉट इन्वेस्ट माय टंग इन चैंटिंग प्रभु पद से चैंट कांस्टेंटली एंड बी हैप्पी एंड दोस हु हैव चैंटेड यू कैन सी दे आर हैप्पी एंड दोस हु आर नॉट चैंटिंग प्रॉपर्ली दे आर नॉट हैप्पी वेरी सिंपल वेरी सिंपल इनिशियली इट मे बी लिटिल स्ट्रगल to chant the tongue is not used to so the tongue will find excuses and you will see for other topics the tongue becomes very light it moves very easily and when the time to chant comes the tongue becomes very thick and heavy doesn't move only sometimes i have seen one hour and i see my bead, beads only six rounds are done i'm thinking what is wrong <laughs> definitely i have either slept or i've got distracted sometimes hari krishna hari krishna 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 hari hari four five mantras are over and only one bead i have not moved the bead only because there is no uh, focus right the mind is thinking something else so not like that the tongue should be even if the tongue becomes very heavy we force the tongue to chant in the mukunda mala stotra king kulashekhar writes आश्चर्य मनुष्य लोके सुधा परित्यज विषम पिबंती नामा नारायण गोचरा त्यक्वन्य वार्ता कुहका पठन आश्चर्य मनुष्य लोके ये आश्चर्य है मनुष्य लोक का दिस इज एस्टॉनिशिंग इन द ह्यूमन सोसाइटी व्हाट इज इट सुधा परित्यज विषम पिबंती अमृत को छोड़कर विष पीने के लिए लालय थे लोग पीपल आर ईगर टू ड्रिंक Uh, poison more than nectar then the question is what is nectar and what is poison namani narayana gocharani the names of the supreme lord are nectar and tyaktva anya varta kuhaka pathanti and all other topics are poison <laughs> because any other topic apart from krishna katha and krishna naam will cause the mind to be contaminated and krishna katha and krishna naam will purify the mind I remember one time Brajachandra Prabhu from Radha Gopina Temple. Um, I got to associate with him in a home program, and in that class he said, "It's been many years now. Uh, I would say more than twelve years." <laughs> so my mind may trick me also, but to the best of what I remember, he said his grandfather taught him a principle, and what is that? हरी कथा ही कथा बाकी सब व्यथा ही व्यथा ओनली कृष्ण कथा इज कृष्ण कथा बाकी सब दुख संसार वार्ता इस जगत का इज अननेसेसरी इट इज ब्रोकन फर्नीचर कबाड़ा कचरा नो नीड टू एक्यूमुलेट इदम शरीरम परिणाम अपेशलम पतत्य वशम पतत्यवश्यम शतसंधि झरझरम किम औषधम पृछसी मूड दुर्मते निरामयम कृष्ण रसायनम पिव अनदर ब्यूटीफुल वर्स किंग कुलशेखर सेस व्हाट इज द प्रॉब्लम इदम शरीरम परिणाम अपेशलम पतत्यवश्यम शतसंधि झरझरम दिस बॉडी ऑफ आवर्स मेड आउट ऑफ हंड्रेड्स एंड हंड्रेड्स ऑफ जॉइंट्स फॉर श्योर विल फॉल डाउन वन डे हेल्पलेसली एट डेथ देन व्हाट इज द सॉल्यूशन Kim aushadam prichasi mooda durmate. King Kulashekar is saying, "Oh fool! Now ask me what is the solution? Prichasi, puchho mujhe. Kim aushadam prichasi? Kya aushadi hai? Tab main bataunga. At that time, I will say, 'Nirama yam Krishna rasayanam piva. Arey Krishna naam ka rasayan pite roho. Raspan karte roho is Krishna naam ka. Ye tumara kabi chal nahi karega, kabi ahit nahi karega." this holy name of the supreme lord will never cheat you will never cause a down, downfall sometimes we may read shastra and we may have different understanding we may not understand it properly sometimes we may see negative examples in the version of community but these are not things that we should see our eternal friend is the holy name 
Srila Bhaktivinoda Thakur has said, in this material world, there are only two truths. Everything else is Nashwar. It is temporary. Only two things are eternal. The Jiva and Krishna's holy name. And when both of them interact, then Krishna Prem rises. Oshta Spandana Matrena. Just like when you take two rocks and you rub them, the inner fire comes out. Is it not? So similarly, when you take these two rocks in the form of the lips and you constantly rub them by chanting Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare. What happens? The inner fire of Krishna Bhakti rises automatically. And that fire will burn down all the wood in the form of anarthas, aparad and all the karmic reactions. In the pastime of Subuddhi Rai in Chaitanya Charitamrit, Subuddhi Rai uh, loses his caste because of some pastime. So all the Brahmanas, they are very uh, angry with him. So he asks, what is the Prayash Chitta? Some people say you have to commit suicide. Some say you have to enter fire. Somebody said you have to drink poison. Somebody said you have to drink hot ghee through the <laughs> burning ghee through the throat. He was not ready to do any of this. He came to Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and said, what is the way by which I can do Prayash Chitta? And Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu said, Prabhu kahe aite tumi jao Brindavan, nirantara karo Krishna naam sankirtan. You go to Brindavan and constantly chant Krishna's name, Krishna will protect you. You don't worry. So all of you are living in Brindavan already. It is the home of Sri Brindavan Chandra, Sri Sri Radha Brindavan Chandra. Every temple that Prabhupada created and installed deities is Brindavan. So we have to live there and Nirantara Karo Krishna Nam Sankirtan. Did you see the word Nirantara? Nirantara means constant. Antamane Ant, conclusion, yeah, end. Or Nirantara, which means constantly. In Shastra, you can see this word again and again, constantly. Like Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu also in the Shikshashtakam when he says Kirtani Hari, right? We have to worship Hari. But he in, in, inserts a word in the middle. What kind of chanting should it be? Kirtaniya Sada Hari. The word Sada means don't stop. Constantly chant Krishna's name. Constantly chant. Similarly, in the Bhagavad Gita, Krishna has said, Yajnanam Japa Yajnyosmi. Of all the yajnas, I am the chanting of the holy name. But how should that be done? In the Bhagavad Gita only, Krishna says, Satatam kirtayan tomam. Mera kirtan kaisa hona chahiye? Satat hona chahiye. Even in the Bhagavatam, before we study Bhagavatam, what is the word that is used? Nashta prayeshu abhatreshu nityam Bhagavata sevaya. So the word sada, satatam, nityam, nirantara, in the prayers of Queen Kunti, <clears throat> the word Abhikshnasha has come. Shunvanti Gayanti Grinanti Abhikshnasha Smaranti Nandanti Tave Hitajana Abhikshnasha means constantly. So the word Nirantara Abhikshnasha Sada Satatam Nityam all of mean without break. Whatever we are doing hands and legs must move but the tongue must also move inside. Or kabhi kabhi uche kant mein bol sakte hain. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare, in the form of Kirtan. And sometimes it is Japa. Sometimes it's possible we are on a, in a book stall. Our services is at the book stall to take care of the books distribution. At that time we cannot do Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare loudly because people may come to purchase the books. So what we have to do at that time? We have to speak to them about the books. But between two customers, we should chant. <laughs> Where is the difficulty? Kya parishani hai? Shripad Bilba Mangala Chakur has also said, Vaktum samartho api na vakti kaschid Aho jananam vyasana bhimukhyam Jivhe pibaswa amrita meta deva Govinda damodara madhareti Shripad Bilba Mangala Chakur says, Vaktum samarthaha Still the person doesn't chant. How eager are people? How eager are people to destroy their human form? What is the solution? 
जिभा से रसपान करते रहो अमृत में तो देव ये वास्तविक अमृत है दिस इज नेक्टर श्रीपाद बिल्व मंगल ठाकुर से गोविंद दामोदर माधव इति द नेम्स ऑफ श्री हरि बाय चैंटिंग कृष्णस नेम वी विल नेवर बी चीटेड इन द पास्ट टाइम ऑफ अजामिल आल्सो द यमदूतस व्हेन दे गेट कंफ्यूज्ड दे आस्क यमराज दे आस्क यमराज हाउ डू वी नो वेयर टू गो एंड वेयर नॉट टू गो सो यमराज गिव्स अ वेरी नाइस यार्ड स्टिक अ प्रॉपर स्टैंडर्ड यमराज सेज जिह्वान वक्ति भगवत गुण नाम धेयम चेतश्च तत्स्मरति न चरणारविंदम कृष्णाय नो नमति तत्शिर एकदापि तन आनयद्धो मसतो कृत विष्णु कृत्यान यमराज सेज दोज हेड्स व्हिच डोंट बाव डाउन इन द फॉर्म ऑफ प्रणाम इन द ऑफरिंग ओबेसेंसेस ब्रिंग सच पीपल दोज माइंड्स व्हिच डोंट थिंक ऑफ कृष्णा ब्रिंग सच पीपल एंड जिह्वा न वक्ति भगवत गुण नाम धेयम and those tongues which don't chant the holy name bring such people to me but out of these three consideration first line is jivha na vakti bhagavat guna naam dhe yamraj is saying those tongues which don't chant unko to ghasit ke le aao le aao yahan par so not chanting is only going down slope agar acha na lage to phir bhi naam jap acha lage na lage ये जान करके इससे मेरा उद्धार होगा आई विल बी बेनिफिटेड बाई दिस आई विल बी बेनिफिटेड बाई दिस प्रभु का और कौन सा रूप है इस जगत वी के नॉट सी द फॉर्म ऑफ द लॉर्ड वी के नॉट हियर हिज फ्लूट वी के नॉट हियर हिज वॉइस वी के नॉट हियर हिज एंकल बेल वी के नॉट स्मेल द फ्रेग्रेंस ऑफ कृष्ण बॉडी वी के नॉट सी हिज पास टाइम्स बट वी हैव हिज नेम we have his name krishna's name is like the seed of a banyan tree we cannot see the banyan tree but it is all there in the seed now the way we take care of this seed the whole banyan tree will fructify isko rakhna nahi hai khazana samajh kar kahin andar locker mein rakhna nahi chalo aaj ki mala ho gayi ab rakh do nahi mala ho gayi wo to minimum hai prabhu pad said 16 rounds minimum like for example in schools also 35 is the passing mark out of 100 right 35 or 40 if the child comes home and the uh, the mother asks how was the exam he says oh yes i will get 35 or 40 then i don't know about 35 or 40 you will definitely get a thappad <laughs> the mother will give him prasad at home only she will say why only 35 or 40 why not 90 why not 95 right so bare minimum is the bare minimum we have to not meet the target we have to beat the target even the time on the day of our death our counter read should, counter beat should read minimum 16 but apart from that when we have time instead of talking instead of sleep, over sleeping during day time in the afternoon sleeping one and a half hours two hours instead of eating more and feeling lazy we want to even it's even if it we skip a meal or we reduce our eating no problem we can increase our chanting our human form is a rare achievement prabhu kahe vaishnav seva naam sankirtan dui karo shigra pave krishna ra charan mahaprabhu said serve the vaishnavas without criticizing them and constantly chant krishna's name mahaprabhu has given guarantee that krishna will give you darshan what what is the difficulty then chaitanya bhagavat says कहारे न करे निंदा कृष्ण कृष्ण बोले अजय चैतन्य शही जीनी बे कह महाप्रभु हैज सेड द डोंट क्रिटिसाइज एनी बडी एंड कॉन्स्टेंटली चैंट कृष्ण नेम महाप्रभु हैज गिवन गारंटी आई विल गिव यू कृपा आई विल गिव यू आई विल शावर मर्सी श्रील भक्ति विनोद ठाकुर हैज ऑल्सो सेड मुकुंद माधव यादव हरि बोलो रे बोलो भाई वदन भरी मुख को भर भर कर नाम लो <laughs> वदन है भरी हम रसगुल्ला पाते हैं तो एक रसगुल्ला दो रसगुल्ला तीन रसगुल्ला मुख भरने तक पाते हैं तो व्हाई नॉट द होली नेम नाउ वेरी सिंबॉलिक इफ यू सी व्हेन यू चैंड द माउथ नेवर गेट्स फुल हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 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 कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 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 कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे मुख देखो फिर भी खाली है भरा नहीं है 
Srila <laughs> Bhaktivinoda Thakur says, Mukunda Madhava Yadava Hari, the names of Hari. Bolo re bolo bhai, vadana bhari. Till the time the mouth doesn't get full, keep chanting. <laughs> bol hari bol, bol hari bol, bol hari bol. Manav janwe pe bhai, bol hari bol. Suke thako, dukhe thako, bol hari bol. Krishna rasam sare thaki, bol hari bol. Vaishnave charane padi bol hari bol. Bol hari bol, bol hari bol, bol hari bol. So many songs, is it not? Am I saying something of my own mind? I am simply trying to present what our Acharyas have given. And everybody is saying that. All our Acharyas talk about constantly chanting Krishna's name. Lochandas Thakur has said, Nitai Gaura Naam, Anandera Dham, Jejana Nahi Lai, Tarayam Rai, Dhare Lai Jai, Narake Dubai Tai, Narake Dubai Tai. What do you say? Bhot Saral Bangla hai. Very easy, straightforward Bengali. Lochandas Thakur says, Nitai Gaura Naam Anandera Dham. The names of the Lord are the abode of joy. Je Jana Nahi Loy. And still if a person doesn't chant, Tara Yamarai. Unke li Yamaraj bethe hai. O kya karte hai? What does Yamaraj do? Tare Yamarai dhare lai jai naraka dubai. <laughs> he will take such people and drown them in naraka for being lazy and not chanting. So by chanting Krishna's holy name, all good qualities will come. How did Jagai and Madai get uplifted? It is described, they started constantly chanting and serving the Vaishnavas. And they also became brahmacharis. The word brahmachari has come for them. Although they were not brahmacharis, right? They broke regulative principles, but in the past. They, they gave up everything. And then they chanted constantly and served the Vaishnavas. As a result, they were considered to be as great as brahmacharis. Fixed up brahmacharis. So in this way, we can see in Shastra everywhere, whether Bhagavad Gita, whether Bhagavatam, whether Chaitanya Charita Amrit, whether Nectar of Devotion, um, even Nectar of Instruction. Yen Nama Rupa Charita Di Sukirta Nano Sprityo Kramena Rasana Manasi Niyujya Tishthan Vrajeta Danuragi Jananu Gami Kalam Nayet Akhila Mithi Upadesha Sara. The eighth verse of Nectar of Instruction. Upadesha Amrita. Srila Rupa Goswami Pad has said, Kalam nayet akhilam. Use all your time. And Prabhupada in the translation in the bracket here writes 24 hours a day. <laughs> in what? Tan naam rupa charita di sukirtananu smrityo kramena rasana manasi niyunche. In constantly thinking of Krishna, but then Srila Rupa Goswami Pad says, manasi niyunche, man ko niyukta karne se pehle rasana jiva ko niyukta karo. Engage the tongue constantly before engaging the mind. By constantly chanting. Man lage na lage. Sometimes people say, but my mind is distracted. No problem. Continue to chant. Continue to chant. Sankhyatyam, parihasyam, sthobam, helanam evava, vaikuntha nam grahanam, ashesh agaharam vidu. This name will never cheat us. Whether we chanting through yawning or whether we are chanting while sneezing, whether we are willingly chanting, unwillingly chanting, knowing, unknowingly, you touch an electric wire, we will get electrocuted. The holy name of Krishna is like that. If you write Amrit on a bottle which is actually filled with poison and you worship it and you do parikrama and drink, what happens? Still, it, it's poison only. <laughs> What we think of the poison doesn't matter. The, the vastava shakti, vastu shakti, the swabhavik shakti of poison will act. So when poison can act, when fire can act, when electric wire can act, why won't Krishna's name act? Even if we are sleepy, even if we are lazy, even if we are walking, even if we are sitting, even if we are yawning, even if we are sneezing, the name that comes through our tongue will never cheat us. Never cheat us. Kechit kevalaya bhaktiya vasudeva parayana agam dhunvanti karsneha niharaniva bhaskar. 
the sixth canto bhagavatam describes just like clouds and fog are all cut to pieces by the rays of the sun all the darkness of the heart are cut to pieces by the sun of the holy name so i will pause here uh, the essence of the whole discussion is param vijayate shri krishna sankirtana all glories all glories all glories to the holy name of shri hari by constantly keeping that holy name in our tongue we will never be cheated dear devotees we will never be cheated jo bhi abhishth hai whatever we are desiring will all come true all desires spiritual desires will come true even if you are unqualified we just have to accept the holy name given by mahaprabhu shraddhavan jan he shraddhavan jan he prabhu agyaye bhaye mage ei bhiksha bolo krishna bhajo krishna koro krishna siksha <laughs> just by constantly chanting krishna's name let's say we are folding our dhoti we are putting pleats to our dhoti before we run for mangal aarti why we are hands are putting pleats na why tongue should be quiet we can chant in the mouth we can the lips can be closed the tongue can move try lips are closed tongue is moving and pleats for the dhoti are being put before mangal aarti we are coming down the stairs 2 3 minutes left when we are very late for mangal aarti 2 3 minutes left just before curtain i believe we are supposed to sit there and chant a few rounds before the curtain opens but we are running down in anxiety that the conch shell blowing and my coming in somehow krishna please save me <laughs> even during those times we can chant even while bathing we should chant even while eating we can chant with every morsel chaitanya charitamrit describes mahaprabhu used to say while feeding the devotees say hari bol hari hari and take morsels which means we are taking one let's say we take one roti or we take rice and dal and in the mouth according to ayurveda we have to chew 16 times and we know <laughs> how to do it we are chewing and the mind for every chewing is saying one word one name hare krishna hare krishna krishna bahar se to bhakt dekh rahe hain ki ye chaba raha hai <laughs> prasad pa raha hai पर अंदर से नाम का आस्वादन हो रहा है ये केवल ठाकुर जानते हैं केवल प्रभु जानते हैं एक्सटर्नली पीपल आर सींग दैट वी आर एक्सेप्टिंग प्रसाद बट इंटरनली वी आर एक्सेप्टिंग द होली नेम दैट ओनली परमात्मा श्री हरी सी सो इन दिस वे इन वृंदावन देश दुनिया के काम करते रहिए हरे कृष्ण नाम जपते रहिए आवर हैंड्स एंड लेग शुड मूव इन सर्विस कॉन्स्टेंटली एंड इन साइड अवर टंग शुड मूव सो इन दिस वे at all times we should try to be as engaged as possible prana prayana samaye kapavata pittai kanthavarodana vidav smaranam kutaste when the time of death comes only this practice will help us nothing else will help people who are around us who are glorifying us or criticizing us they may not even be there next to us when we die but if we give our time to krishna's holy name krishna's holy name will give his time at the time of our death when we need him the most hari naam prabhu ki jai shila prabhu pad ki jai gaur pranam